is Go! Amazo. I'm still setting up because I wasn't ready for them to start. So uh, we're gonna sit on the screen for a little bit. Okay. Are we, are, so you're online right now? Yes. Oh, fantastic. What is up, guys? Thanks for watching. Fight number one on uh, 110. I'm sorry. Yeah. I got Amazo versus. What was his name? Hard for guys to You are a will. Okay. A lot of Mars lately. Uh, we saw Leo really inspire the nation with his Mars play yeah. over the past few months. So from that point on, a lot of our Mars out. Mars is a very fun character, don't get me wrong. I mean, you gotta just. You just do things. I don't know like how to explain Marth. Marsh is a very a very well designed character. And now, because, after like three sets of buffs. I just mean like his his tool set. Not not the effectiveness of the tool set, but the tools themselves. Very well designed character, but uh, he has he said he's, he's had a few buffs. I may as well not care about those buffs right now though. Uh, he got first hit he got first hit weak there. He could have done something from the sick out of that. But uh it's kinda hard to react to it, because getting first hit weak there is uh Kind of suboptimal because you're coming inside of their shield, and if they power shield, you're just like, well, <laughs> that happened. Yeah, so this match was actually more of a problem uh, for Mark than it was in previous iterations of Smash. Because it used to be pretty close, but Diddy's forward air is much more of a problem in this game for Mark than it does in now. Uh, I, I hear a lot of Diddy players say it's even or slightly Mark favorite, actually. And yeah, Mark has a lot of kill power. But forward air, uh, hard to do it. Because Mars forward air isn't as good as it used to be, he can't do what Diddy's forward air as well as he used to as well either. So Diddy can get, can keep him spaced out with his aerials. Mars still has a hard time, but... And Mars can chase him off stage though. That's true, Mars can chase him off stage. Uh, Tipper Mars fair off stage because like, now. <laughs> <laughs> it's like 60, like it's, it's not even, it's absurd. Yeah, on top of that, Mars has ridiculous amounts of kill power. So, Dylan's a solid, solid space um, for a smash. I think Mars is probably one of the characters that actually gets the most out of perfect pivoting. Just that micro spacing helps him out so much. That's true. That happened him out so far though. About to get two stock middle uh, nicely. Oh here. no! All right, he got that jab. He had the he had the mix up and F smash, but I couldn't find it. Oh, I guess the classic banana down to up smash and wow, and fat two stock for Amazo here in the first game. Amazo just kind of did Diddy things and it worked. Yeah, that it's harder for Murph to deal with standard stuff from Diddy in this game. Like the forward air and things like that. It's like he used to just forward air through and not really care what you're doing. But now it's like, okay, I have to actually worry about it more. I have often. to actually play the game. <laughs> I think you put it like that. So go on to, you can put it that way if you like. So go on the battlefield for game two. A little bit, should make it a little bit easier to approach Diddy Kong with the platforms. Uh, let's see if we can take advantage of that. Amazing. Not much really change. I mean, you get a two stock game one. Not much coach I can give you here. Just I mean, it's it also kind of hard for Mars to deal with Diddy just sitting under a platform with banana. It's like, what do you do about that? That's true. Amazo really hasn't been sitting in place that often with that in front of his, in front of him though. Oh, I feel like Amazo doesn't feel the need to camp right now. Is it, uh, that's also true. But uh, it doesn't mean he won't though. <laughs> sitting under that platform pretty happily. It's a smart play too. It makes it hard to jump in on him. But because he was so active in the first game, Will thought to go here for the counter pick. It's not a bad pick for Diddy come live around a lot. And also, the high ceilings helps him not die to uh, down to up smash for a while. That's true. So he, now he just has to look for the F smash mix up. Yeah. Now, we're both in stock, so. You know, this one's, oh, nice catch, Daryl. Still a purpose or not, but. Uh, I feel like Marsh should be looking for a lot more grabs. It's hard, it's, it's hard to get close to him right now. He's not, he's not getting close enough to grab. He's trying to stay in the spacing range for the aerials, but he's not getting close enough to even like have a grab threat. But every time uh, Mark does a short hop in front of Diddy, he, I mean, Diddy's going to expect an aerial, obviously. So he's, he's going to respond with either an aerial of his own or uh, a shield. So I like a tomahawk grab would be really nasty right about now. Yeah. Let's see if he goes from when he goes to he, four ears, he aerials see? every time. He, he just... Every time, every time Marsh short hops, Diddy shoot hard button. <laughs> you aren't grabbing. It's that smart stuff. Diddy shoots so great. This should be like, oh, gets the up tilt with the anti here. And maybe they're looking on his second two stock right now. Yeah, maybe a uh, maybe a shield break up or just Tom Hart grab. Like, yeah, the big thing for Will, he has to find a way to really make that Mazo shield more often. He's not having a good time of that so far. I mean, Amazo, every time he's short hopping at him, he's shielding. See, or at chopping at him. I mean. When he has him on the ground making him shield. I suppose. Uh, maybe more dancing blade in neutral or just movement in general. Is the plan very well or not? Waiting it out. As you're saying, being very patient with under the platform, they're doing anything crazy. Get away from the aerial on the shield, blocking and punish. 
Well, a little more movement in this game, but not working out for him quite yet. And he get this stock off, it's for his confidence. You know we're going to lose that being double two stock. We're gonna yeah. have at least one stock off to help out the confidence going for that losers run. Well, tough around. Let's go for banana. Oh, <laughs> unfortunate. That's silly. I don't know if he wanted to grab it or what there, but uh, there it is again. And that higher uh, ceiling, not enough to help him out there. Another two stock by him, though. I mean, sometimes it happens. Rough stuff there. Mizzle's gonna move on and we